Hello, thanks for joining me today. I hope you can learn something as I prepare a meal in this video. The star of the show today is a T-bone steak. Uh, and this steak was actually grown by me. And so the benefits of this is I know everything that went into the cow. I know exactly the diet it had. Um, and so I'm able to control what it ate, uh, how it gained its muscle and stuff. And so I have a really high quality end product. Uh, and so I'm not obviously everyone has this chance. But this is the a benefit that you gain from shopping locally uh, and buying steaks from people that you know. Uh, if you get your meat from the producer, you can learn a lot more about the animal um, and how the meat is going to be good for you. Uh, and so steaks are a really good option for meat. Um, for 100 grams of steaks, it's got 27 grams of protein. Steaks are also a great food choice because it contains all the essential uh, amino acids that our body needs. And these are things that our body cannot make enough of themselves and so we have to get them from the food we consume. And there are diets, um, there are food, food products that contain many of these amino acids, but beef is one that contains all of the ones we can't get in one package, so it's a really great cho choice. So for my first side, I went ahead and picked asparagus. Uh, and the great thing about asparagus is it grows, um, for me, at least readily available. Uh, so it grows in our yard and it's a perennial, so it comes back year after year. And it really doesn't even take any care. Um, as long as it rains, um, it'll come back. And so it's great. You can pick it many times uh, in, a, in a growing season. And so you can get many harvests from the asparagus and it's easily available. So it's a great it's a great vegetable. It's also high in fiber, so it's good for your diet. Lastly here we have a sweet potato. Uh, and I pick sweet potatoes because they've always been a favorite of mine, but they're also very healthy for you. Uh, so these have lots of vitamin A, vitamin C, and antioxidants. And the great thing about all of these vegetables is they're easy to grow uh, yourself. So you could absolutely raise these yourself uh, and if not, you could locally source them um, so you can know where they came from, who raised them, how they were raised, what um, chemicals and stuff were used on them. And there you have it guys. I have a T-bone steak, asparagus, and a, and a baked sweet potato. Thanks for watching and I hope you learned something.